Oh, the UAE Handicap is next up. Uh, this is a two mile one furlong 0 to 90. There's a rather large field for this. Uh, 0 to 90. Over two miles and one furlong. Clip bales at the top for Satyam Sandra Sagram. Won a hatful already this season. Chicago Medic Padre Hogan. Archduke Ferdinand and Jeopardy for Graham Clitterbuck. William Wordsworth, Paul Rhodes, The Big Hearth, Obi Wan, Deep Backward Square, Satyam Sandra Sagram, Meg Mucklebones, Martin Little Star, Deli Alex Cherry, Ferozzi, Nickers, Dan Hughes, Harlem Raw, Stu Gray, Alessia Ransom, Thomas Rogers, Captain Paddy, Alex Cherry, and Matt Cooper's got the bottom two, Louise and Winston. They're all installed and ready to go, and away they go. A little bit slow at Winston and Harlem Raw. Those two will no doubt be in the lead shortly. But that's big, deep backward square. Oh, Satyam the Grey has burst out into the lead though now. And has opened up quickly by about three lengths to William Wordsworth in second. And Chicago Medic is third. And then Winston is indeed coming through into fourth. Clip Bales and then Louise. Satyam is uh, blazing the trail at the moment with deep backward square. His cricketed referenced horses. I'm pretty good season in fact his entire stable is having a pretty good season he's got to be the most improved trainer in the league gone from down he's sort of bottom end wins wise to be right he's right up in the top 10 i think he's in about the top five or six on wins as they pass the winning post with a circuit to go i don't count the money as the championship because we include all those races from all over the world if it's a you want to make it a money championship then you've got to split the countries up because you can't be having the Dubai races and the Japan races and the big big purse foreign races lumped in with the English ones to make it a proper championship so we have to do it on numbers of winners for it to make any sense in this league as far as I'm concerned so all those people who think that it should be down to money then personally think you're talking at the top of your hat and you want to take a look at it and think about it you've only got to win one of those early Dubai races and you've got three million in the bank before you even started I think last season I had a horse came second in week one and it earned more money for coming second than I'd earned in the last four years to get all put together on the flat so it's all rather ridiculous to claim the flat championship on money it's got to be on winners unless we get rid of all the foreign races or split it all up but anyway let's get back to this one deep backward square is in the lead winston is second and william wordsworth is third chicago medic is fourth and arch duke ferdinand is in fifth jeopardy after that and then star delhi here comes clipped bales and the big hearth meg mucklebones is after that one deep backward square continues to lead not by quite so far now only by a couple of lengths. Uh, stable mate. Well, not stable mate. Chicago Medic is Padre Hogan in slightly different colours. I'll have to watch these races on a 90 foot screen to be able to tell the difference. I'm exaggerating just a little bit there, but anyway, it's deep backward square in front. Now his stable mate Clip Bales is coming through to challenge, and Clip Bales has suddenly burst into the lead. Star Deli has gone into third. Ferozzi Nickers is now running on nicely into fourth, and these four. Seem to be pulling away from the rest of them who are treading water a little bit. They're past the three pole and clipped bales is too clear of Stardelli in second. Deep backward square on the inside. The pacemaker is now beginning to drop away. For Rosie Nickers is the challenger for second, but clipped bales has shot the field here and he's two lengths clear. It's clipped bales a top weight and he's racing away at the moment. Two, two to three lengths clear of Stardelli and Rosie Nickers. They're not making any impression on this leader at all. And clipped bales looks like another one of those Satyam handicap snippets even though it's top weight he probably shouldn't have got into a 0 to 90 to be fair and racing away four five six lengths clear it's clip bales if that one doesn't go up to 120 something's wrong and jeopardy is second and asked Duke Ferdinand for Rosie Nickers after that one but it was a very easy win there for clip bales for about the third or fourth time this season at least won it by six or seven lengths we shouldn't be getting handicap when it's winning by that, by that far we really shouldn't. Clip bars for Satyam. Sandra Sagram is the winner. Star Deli for Alex Cherry was second. Archduke Ferdinand third for Graham Clutterbuck was also fourth with Jeopardy. And Ferozzi Nickers for Dan Hughes was fifth.